now let's talk about the user vpn so now user vpn everyone knows what it is right it's about connecting your remote users to your uh, data center locations or data center resources so any remote employee i mean in these days i know due to covid 19 pretty much everyone is working from home so everybody needs this solution where you are actually connecting into your um, corporate resources through some vpn service right and in fact we have a, a promotion going on and till the end of june this user vpn solution actually free so you can actually take advantage of it right now so yeah so <clears throat> when you talk to these uh, legacy user vpn provider what they do they basically bring you to the on-prem and then from on-prem you connect to cloud so you're basically taking some extra hops in between so the solution that we have it does not need anything on the on-prem you just need to deploy these uh, gateways these avtx gateways in the cloud and then you can bring your users directly into the cloud or if you want to go towards the on-prem you can go towards the on-prem uh, from here on right so that's not a problem so when you deploy it in your uh, in the architecture this is how it looks like so since these guys are considered to be part of access layer so you basically deploy a vpn vpc or vnet in the cloud access layer and um, and from there you can bring these guys into this transit network and then once they're in the transit network based on the routing or the the criteria that you have you can go towards the destination now the cool thing about this solution is that this solution is actually profile based so you're not configuring these users based on their ip source ip or whatnot you create a profile you say you know these are my partners this is my contractor i want my partner which is the blue line here to go to only the partner vpcs or vnet and the contractor should go to their respective vpcs or vnet so that is something we can easily achieve through our through our solution right so we provide this isolation based on the the personas and uh, not only that but the solution that we have actually allows you to connect to these different idp providers the identity provider right like the duo or octa so if you need single sign on or uh, multi factor authentication or if you if you want extra layer of security we can actually write, redirect the traffic towards those idp provider they get authenticated come back and then we'll send them to the destination right and this is all done through the standard saml um implementation we have in the in our solution so when we program these rules um, to bring those partners or contractors or users into the network these are automatic right so when they are created automatically and when those guys are disconnected we will just destroy these rules they will not stay there forever the solution also supports a split tunneling okay so yeah you can bring everything into the cloud or you can say these are the subnets or the destinations i want to bring in and the rest regular internet traffic should go through the regular internet path so that's also something we support we also provide a client which is um, which what we developed and um, and you should use that client if you want to authenticate through idp because it has everything built in the saml and everything built into the client but if you don't have this requirement you can use any open vpn supported client okay so it's very simple seamless and easy to deploy this is another um, way of looking at it with the multiple cloud in picture and uh, here what you you see here is the same thing same concept same theme repeatable architecture so in aws you have this um, user vpn solution deployed and when we deploy it we will automatically spin up this nlb in aws or if it is azure we will automatically do the same thing because obviously in the production uh, network you want to make sure you have multiple gateways available to take the request for high availability and performance needs <clears throat> 